It's actually not just the toe cap. There are multiple differences between these two boots, the captain boot and the president boot from Thursday Poot Company. Literally this morning when I went to the grocery store, I saw three pairs of these boots out on the street. And what I've got here is actually three boots as well. This is the brown and the terracotta captain boot. And this is the tobacco rugged and resilient president boot. As you can see, I've absolutely worn these boots to hell because I actually wear the boots that I make videos about. But you are here because you wanna know what's the same and what's different between the two models of boots. Both are the same price, which is $199, which is just like the best value boot you can find. Both of the boots have 360 degree Goodyear welt. Uh, that makes them very water resistant and very easy to resole as well. So they can last a long, long time. They both got full grain leather. They're both leather lined for a nice soft feeling. And uh, speaking of which, they both have a shock absorbing foam in the insole as well, which makes for a more modern feeling underfoot. Like they feel less like walking around on hardwood than uh, like Red Wings, for example, which are very old fashioned construction. You know, this construction and this kind of dress boot, work boot hybrid they've got going for them really make a Thursday boots like a more modern boot that again, I see constantly on the streets out here in New York. So those are the similarities. They fit the same, same sizing as well, same everything. The first difference is indeed that toe cap. Let's get that out of the way. That's the main difference. Every version of the captain boot has an extra strip of leather over the toe. It's worth emphasizing that it is indeed an extra strip of layer. It's not just decorative. It's not just a decorative stitch here. They have put an extra layer over the toe. So it offers like a fraction more protection to your toe. Nothing too crazy. I wouldn't really emphasize the protectiveness angle here. What I would emphasize though is that it does add a bit more structure to the toe. And also toe caps can sometimes make small feet look smaller. So if you don't want to accentuate that, then uh, you might want to get the plain toe boot instead. Number two, the second difference is the speed hooks. At the time of filming, all the captain boots have speed hooks. That's these uh, two layers up here that make you able to more speedily lace the boots up. But only some of the presidents have speed hooks. In fact, a number of the president boots are available with or without speed hooks. Like you get to decide if your black, brown or natural president boots will come with speed hooks or not. But yeah, right now, no speed hooks on most of the presidents, making the boot a little dressier and a little bit simpler. And also means that the presidents take a little bit longer to get on and off if they don't have the speed hooks. This is actually a deal breaker for some guys. Some guys are just like speed hooks or bust. If it's a big deal to you, any cobbler can just like replace the eyelets with speed hooks for a few bucks. But it's worth emphasizing that there are more speed hook free boots on the president line than the captain line. The third difference. The third difference is the widths. At the moment, there's just one president boot that's available in wider widths, and that is this one, the tobacco, which is the most popular one, I believe. Again, this will probably change, but out of uh, about a dozen leathers of the president, only this one here comes in widths for double E and triple E feet. Meanwhile, the captain has five right now, so the captain is a much better bet for dudes with wide feet. That said, Thursday's standard width is advertised as fitting D and E width feet, whereas the wide width is for double E and triple E. So if you are an E dude, you'll still be fine with the standard widths on Thursday boots. But if you're any wider than that, you've got a lot more options for the captain boot than the president boot. Number four in the list of differences between these boots, if you are shopping for a captain or a president boot, is the sole options. Uh, this one I thought I shouldn't include in this because I'm sure in time Thursday will have the same soles available for both boots. but. Right now, Thursday's new-ish sole, the Storm King, is only available on the captain boot. I mean, it's available on other boots as well. I've got them on my legend Chelsea's from Thursday, but I'm saying you can't buy the President with this extra grippy, extra functional, and extra tall sole at the moment. It's only available on four leathers on the captain. That number might change, but right now, only you can get the, love, the luggy uh, Storm King sole on the captain. You can't get it on the President boot. Finally, the fifth and last difference between the captain and the president is the leathers. Some leathers are only available on one of them and not the other. So you can get both with brown Thursday Chrome. It's this one, also natural Chrome XL, which are sort of Thursday's classic leathers that they've had from the beginning. Otherwise, there are not a lot of leathers you can get on both of these boots. Like this really cool saddlewood, rugged and resilient leather is not available on the captain boot. Other leathers you can only get on the President at the moment include Frontier, Mahogany, and Black Coffee. Meanwhile, leathers you can only get on the Captain boot out of these two include Terracotta, this one here, Old English, and some of the cool weatherproof suede like Burnt, Ginger, and Midnight. Generally speaking, the Captain, being the more popular boot, is available in more leathers and more experimental leathers too. Like there are very classic ones, but stuff like the vaguely orange Burnt Ginger or the Midnight Blue Suede, 
Typically those kind of colors will wind up as options for the captain. That's a bit of a generalization, but uh, yeah, the, you'll find more experimentation going on with the captain than on the president of the boot, generally speaking. And that's all the differences between these two very, very popular boots. The main takeaway here is that the Captain is more popular, so there are more ways you can buy the Captain. Storm King sole, unusual leathers, more widths. The Captain isn't always has been Thursday's flagship boot, so that's where you'll see the brand having fun and like sort of trying out different styles, unusual leathers, that kind of stuff. The President is a tad more traditional as far as aesthetics go, but I absolutely love wearing them both. As you can see, I'm not making this up. Uh, let me know if you've got a favorite below and why, and uh, make sure you subscribe as well. So I've got a lot more boot videos, and also videos about jackets like this one here and jeans and other kinds of stuff coming up.